Right, we now cross over to our journalist Muzamil Abdullah, who is reporting live from Axiata Reina Stadium in Bukit Jalil with the latest updates on today's Himpunan Pembebasan Palestine Rally. Muzamil, over to you. The Perhimpunan Pembebasan Palestine event will begin soon here at the Azeta Arena in Bukit Jalil and it is slated to continue until 11pm uh, tonight. Now we are expecting a crowd of 20,000 people from various walks of life to come here and show their solidarity towards the plight of the Palestinians at the hands of the Zionist regime. Now when I arrived here earlier, uh, around, uh, earlier this evening, I saw supporters painting their faces with Palestinian colours, uh, kids with stickers of, pa of watermelons and Palestinian flags across their cheeks, men and women waving the Palestinian flag while chanting slogans supporting uh, the Palestinian country and calling for an end to the occupation by the illegal state of Israel. Now here's a brief rundown of what we are expecting to happen here tonight. Now it kickstarts with a number of public speaking and poem sessions as well as performances by local artists such as Amir Masti and Faisal Tahir and also by the children of Palestine themselves. Now then approximately around 9.20 p.m. a list of cabinet ministers such as Stephen Sim, Datuk Sri Saifuddin Asution, Datuk Sri Ahmad Zahid Hamidi will deliver their speeches showing their support towards Palestine and this will be followed by the final speech uh, which will be delivered by none other than the Prime Minister himself, Datuk Sri Anwar Ibrahim. And then we will have a few more performance le uh, performances left before this event, Himpunan Timbabasan Palestine, concludes around 11 p.m. So we are expecting the supporters to come in droves later tonight as the hour continues. And all these empty seats that you see behind me and also the centre uh, stage or the centre area in front of the stage will be uh, field tonight. Now for those who are interested to make their way here, you uh, feel free to do so and uh, if possible, please take the LRT, the light rail transit, to ensure that, uh, to ensure that you will not be faced with uh, the difficulties of going in and out of the Azeta Arena. So stay tuned to Bernama TV for more news updates. We will be here throughout the night and we will continue to do a few more live crosses with you and tell you more updates regarding this event, Bumibas and Palestine, here at the Azeta Arena, Bukit Jalil. Muzamil Abdullah, Bernama TV.